Trips to the state softball tournament in Madison on the line today in Division Two. Top seeded Seymour took on Winnicani in the sectional championship. Seymour gets things going in the second inning when Chloe Evans smashes a triple to the fence in left center field. Two run score, two nothing. Seymour still in the inning for the Thunder. Diana King, the infield single, that's going to plate Evans. Seymour goes up 3 0. More from the Thunder in the third inning. Patricia Neeland gets a hold of one. She sends the two run blast just over the fence in left. Seymour headed to state for the first time in program history, winning 13 7. In a D3 sectional final, Southern Door took on Oconto. Third inning, Southern Door's Jacqueline Atkins with the single into shallow left field there. That brings home Grace LaGrave, 1 0 Eagles. Fifth inning now, Eagles with a runner on third. And it's Evans ripping a shot, or Atkins, I should say, the shot to first. Natalie Jandron beats the throw home. Southern door up 2 0. Still in the inning for the Eagles. Lexi Weary rips a double down the left field line. Two more runs come around to score. And for the first time since 2008, Southern door state bound. They win 5 0. Oshkosh North improves their perfect record on the season to 28 and 0. They slide by rivals Oshkosh West 5 to 3. The top ranked Spartans headed back to state for the third time in four years. In Division Two, Pulaski topped West the Pier 5 to 2. Red Raiders also Madison bound. And in Division Three, Michigan will be searching for their first win at state in program history. They beat Iola Scandinavia 7 to 3 in their sectional championship.